Hi, I am Francis, the host of this show, Cooking with the Dog. こんにちは。今日はさつまいもを使った美味しいお菓子を作ります。Let's cook the sweet potatoes. Wrap the pre-washed sweet potato in wet paper towel. Wrap the sweet potato tightly in plastic wrap. Wrap it tightly in a double layer of plastic wrap. This process keeps moisture in the sweet potato. Heat the potatoes in a microwave for 5 minutes. Turn them over to heat uniformly. Heat the potatoes 5 to 6 more minutes. Stick a bamboo skewer into the potato to check if the inside is soft enough. Remove plastic wrap and paper towel. Cut the sweet potato vertically in half. While it is still hot, scoop out the flesh of the potato with a spoon. Be careful not to break the skin of the potato. Measure the flesh of the sweet potatoes by weight. Transfer the sweet potato into a heavy saucepan. Add sugar. Mash the sweet potato with a potato masher. Add butter and mix it well. Add dairy cream and mix it well. Crack the egg in a bowl. Add the egg yolk into the potato mixture and mix it well. Finally, add rum and a few drops of vanilla extract and stir to combine. Place the saucepan on a stove and heat it at a low heat. Mix lightly until the potato mixture easily comes off the bottom of the saucepan. Quickly transfer the mixture to a plate. Let's stuff the mixture back into the skin of the sweet potato. Use plastic wrap to shape the sweet potato with your hands. Let's make egg yolk paint. Crack the egg into a bowl. Separate the egg yolk from the egg white. Add water to the egg yolk and mix it well. Coat the top of the sweet potatoes with the egg yolk paint. Sprinkle the black sesame seeds on top of the sweet potatoes. Let's make supporting bases to bake the potatoes uniformly. Roll up a sheet of aluminum foil into a pillow shape. Set the baking sheet in an oven and preheat it to 400 degrees. Place the sweet potatoes on each supporting base. Bake at 400 degrees about 10 minutes. Take out the baking sheet from the oven. Do not bake too much since its moist texture will be lost. The surface becomes slightly golden brown and the inside is soft and moist. This is a simple and delicious recipe, and I hope you try it yourself. Thank you for watching.